hope you all are having a tuntastic day. We're in Toon- we're gonna head to Toonsel Town now. I love this. At least it brings me in a good, uh, mood, so. Oh yeah, I could- I could be small, but the problem is it would get rid of my thing. What the fuck did you do that for? Stop- Hey! Stop it! Stop gag uniting! Stop! Stop! Stop, guys! Stop! You know what? Okay, do I have my gag up? <laughs> I am going to scream. Uh, you people are so weird. Okay, that's it. I'm done. All right. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. All right. Seven prizes. Huh? They're alright. The thing is with me. I, I don't just sound young, um, people think I'm, like, a dude, I mean, don't get me wrong, yeah, I'm, I am female, but I actually identify as any gender, so, like, I'm, uh, non-binary, but, um, yeah, obviously I have a guy-like personality, um, some people think I sound like a dude from 7th grade, just about to hit puberty, uh, <laughs> And usually when I correct them, they always get this shocked response, so I think it's really funny. But I, um, I also look young in real life. Please work. <gasps> yes! We got it! We got it! We're in the void! Let's go! Oh, Toon Soul Town's gonna start in three minutes! Let's get in while we get some prizes, because we are halfway done. Is that supposed to be like Patrick, but a cat? Oh my gosh. This person trained all of their gag tracks to get it maxed. Oh my gosh, props to them for doing this. We won six prizes. Alright, good night. Oh, this is so cute. We're a tiny tune! Oh! Okay, to the toy shop. I was wondering why. Okay. Oh, it's the dude. Okay. Ah, uh, not often we get a visitor around here. Welcome, friend. I'm Tinker, the owner of Tinker Toys. Uh, Tinker is toys and one of the driving forces behind supplying toys for Santa to deliver. Blocks, stuffed dolls, train sets, rocking horses, those little squares that hurt even if you step on. <laughs> they referenced Legos! We make them all. Have you been nice this year? Well, we'll see about that. If you help me, I'll give you a little something for being nice. And maybe you can even convince me down the road to make sure you're on Santa's nice list. I've been working with Granny Thread on making some splendid clothing based on my toys. However, it's been a while since I've heard back. Could you go back and see her? She's in the... Okay, knitting shop. Alright. You there, too? Hi there. What's your name? Glacier? Cool. Listen, Glacier. I know we just met, but I have a favor to ask you. You see, Toontown is a wacky world full of wacky things. Those wacky things greatly interest me, so I want some. If you, if you help me out and knock a few of these items off my list, I'll give you something in return. Promise. You'll help me? Thank you. Let's see what, let's see. What's first? Ah, a pair of flunky glasses. I saw a tune running around with some, and they say they got some place called Sky Clan. Could you, uh, swing by and grab me a pair? Oh, well that's a bummer. What use is a playground if it's only temporary? Is there anywhere to get a pair? There is? Could you get me a pair then? I'll reward you generously. 
Uh, thank you, Gla Thanks, Glacier. You're the best. Is that you, Tinker? Oh, Tinker, good news. I'm almost done on that special garment you crusted the other week. Oh, you're not, Tinker? <laughs> well then, what were you going to ask about? Ah, uh, yes, the uh, special garments I was making for Tinker. <laughs> I just need some fine red thread. These uh, pieces of clothing take lots. I've heard rumblings in the vast Toontown knitting community that those law bots carry st a sticky red tape perfect for threading. Do you think you could bring some granny some red tape? Oh, it's a granny. Okay. Thank you, child. Oh, it said it in the name. Well, that was easy. All right, Tonsil Town. All right, Tonsil Town. I keep mispronouncing it. I'm so sorry. Uh, I keep doing that. It's such a habit. I Come on. You got them, Glacier? You're amazing. Your efforts won't go unnoticed. Next, I'll need a bandana. You know, one from that Outback thing that happened? Oh, that's done too. Darn it. Well, is there any other way you could give me one? There is? Sweet. Please, give me one. I'll make it worth your while. Oh my gosh. Okay. Guess we're going to pajama place. Howdy, what can I do for ya? What you have for? A what now? You want a bandana? Well, I usually have some in stock. They make great pillowcases, you know. Anywho, I don't have them anymore. At least not since this morning, anyway. You see, a whole gaggle of them penny pinchers came here and nabbed them all. Went on about how those robber barrets needed them and whatnot. If you can hunt down those penny pinchers and get them back for me, I'll gladly give you one when we part ways. Good luck out there, partner. All right, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. All right. Six prizes. Ooh. Okay, so we need Lobots or Penny Pinchers. Oh, look at that! Penny Pitcher Invasion! <laughs> okay. Yeehaw! You did it, Glacier! Here you go! A bandana, just as promised! See you around! Yay! Thank you so much, Glacier! There's just one thing left on my list. Then you can be on your way. Don't worry, it's not a thing. It's a place. I need you to keep my collection. Toontown is a big place, so surely there's somewhere I can keep my things, right? Do you know of anywhere? Maybe? Well, that's better than nothing, I suppose. Could you go scope it out for me? I promise I'll actually reward you this time. Hey there, Glacier! What can I do for you? The sad, vacant building? What on earth are you asking for that for? A rabbit in to uh, Tinsel Town wants to rent it? Well, it is it is pretty vacant and sad. Alright, I guess we can look into renting it out. It's not like it's being used anyways. I'll just speak with Barnacle Bessie. But it should be an issue. Thanks for stopping by, Glacier. Stay safe out there. All right, Tinsel Town, we go. Glacier. Oh, it's the perfect place for all my things in the future to come. Amazing. It has so much space. It it'll serve me for well for centuries. But I can't have it. Can you believe that? A Bessie covered in barnacles told me my use wasn't practical enough. This barnacled Bessie also said that me moving in would make the building less sad and less vacant and completely removing the appeal. Ridiculous. Though, I guess I can understand. At least I have my items, right? And I have two more thanks to you. I may not be able to take up the residence here, but I can always count on you for help if I visit again. I should probably have warned you now, huh? Thank you so much for your help, Glacier. You've done a lot for me. The happy holidays. I told Toon HQ to send your reward in the mail. You'll receive an location. All right. Five prizes. <gasps> Wait, I wonder. The counterclaim building was over here, right? So what do they do? That's an ice cream part life!
I don't like you. You took my store. You stole my store. My store of my dreams. Um. As you can tell, I'm inside the thing right now. Tinker, is that you? Your special garment is almost ready. Oh, not again. Sorry. Here, get this to Tinker. It's almost complete. Thank you for the red thread. Wait, did you think the red thread was for Tinker's clothing? <laughs> Just wait and you see what this gra old granny knits up. See you around, child. Thank you, Glacier. Let's have a look here. Oh, these are gray and all, but they're simply not finished. They need bells and whistles. I need buttons, knobs, or something. We can't leave it just simply threading. Thankfully for us, I'm a creative problem solver. How about you go out and find a place that you could scrooge up a lot of loose buttons? Screws, a bit of metal, whatever could work. Thank you. No! Cog buildings! Uh... Alright, six prizes, right? Yep. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna have to upload. Oh. Plager. I mean, no. No! <laughs> Whoops. From the Christmas tree. Uh, go home. That's what I meant to do. Oh, goody! You're back! Let's see what you got. Buttons, class, screws, bolts. Ooh, a chocolate coin! This is some great stuff, Glacier. Say, thinking about all these goodies? I had a thought. You're from the mainland of Toontown, right? I heard back in town there's actually solid snowflakes. Is that true? Could you bring me some? I'd like to see what kind of toys I could fashion out of those. Thank you, Glacier. Ah, of course, we gotta get to the burg. These are amazing! They'd make fun wheels. No, wait. They'd be great frisbees. No, 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 no. They'd be... Oh, sorry. I got a bit too excited. I finished fashioning my new clothes while you wore out. Here, I'll send you a pair for free for all the help. I'm gonna be working hard on the next thing to accompany these. So, see me sometime later and we'll see what we can do again. Thanks, Glacier. You're a real toy master now, just like me. <laughs> Alright. Alright, we're gonna have five gifts. Six prizes. Oh yeah, progress update for those who are curious how far I've gone on Avatar. I'm actually almost done with their last Airbender series. I am one episode away. Well, I mean, I just had the three-part uh, finale. And then I'll be on my way to Legend of Korra. So, um, I'm real excited. Okay, spoilers um, for the end of season uh, two, or book two of Earth. I, okay, I'm gonna give you a few seconds to turn away now, and then come back within a few minutes, all right? All right, good. All right, they gone? All right, they're gone. All right, so I still can't believe that um, Aang almost like dies by Azula's lightning strike. If it weren't for Katara, oh my gosh. You know, that would have been horrible. I'm still like, I, I can't believe I took a while to catch up, you know? I've also heard that the play kind of, like the movie is in a way, like the play that they make fun of. And I could I kind of see it, even though I've, I won't, I barely seen the movie and I never want to because the show's way better. <laughs> I'm almost done with the series. I'm just, like, and then I'll be like uh, doing Legend of Korra. It's exciting. And then um, I still need to get enough money for storage for 
to start doing more reactions on Patreon. Um, because I want to do more Steven Universe. Steven Universe is like one of my favorite shows right now. But I get why people don't like the community. <laughs> but the show itself. Mwah, amazing. Like, oh my gosh. Um, but is it the best show ever? Like how they treat uh, My Hero Academia? No. There's no such thing as a, the best show in the world or best movie. That kind of stuff is more based on opinion. There's no factual thing. And the people say, oh, that's just facts and whatever. They're joking. They joke it a little bit too far and it kind of annoys me. You know? Like, hey, I get it. We all have a joke every now and then. But some people just take the jokes a bit too far. Play the, like, play the joke a bit too much that it gets annoying. You know what I mean? But it's the 21st century. You gotta live a little. You know what's upsetting me? Where I live, ramen no longer exists anywhere. Like the actual, the hot ramen stuff, you know, the actual traditional packet stuff. We can't find it anywhere. We can't even find like the cup of noodles or anything. And I'm like, it makes me really upset. Cause like, <sighs> those stuff are good. And it's a lot of work. But let's hope once the world events are over, we can finally have more ramen. You know? Because ramen's just so good. But I should probably have the actual ramen. Uh, from like, uh, people in Japan have. Oh, speaking of which, I need to watch a Gretzko season 4 soon. Top ramen is like my favorite type of ramen. And we just don't have it here. I could order it from Amazon, probably. Three, two, one. Finish. <gasps> I think there's more than 103 items. It's 113. Oh. Oh, hi, Simmy. My cat just arrived. Alright. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Nice! Oh, wait. Did I max? Oh. We did it. So we got everything. I'm getting tired, so... I'm gonna go do, chill out and do my own thing, so I will see you all next time. Have a toontastic day.